7.5 miles per hour. Oh, you dripped sweat on me. Oh, gosh. Oh. Kevin is dripping sweat all everywhere. That was disgusting. Oh, oh. I got me again. Hello and welcome to Team Imagine the Extreme Trivia Series, where when you get an answer wrong, there's extreme consequences. Today, we are doing the treadmill trivia challenge. And we are pitting the brothers against each other. So this is how the game's gonna work, guys. You guys are gonna start at a walking pace. Every question you get wrong, I up the speed. I up <laughs> what the was speed. that? I up the speed. I up, I up the speed. The winner of this game is the person that lasts the longest on the treadmill. Easy. Are you guys prepared? No. It's a big welcome to Kevin, the oldest brother of the group. No. And we're youngest. making our way down to hey. the next oldest, which is Brian, and then the youngest, which is Marvin. I personally have my money on Marvin because he is the most in shape of the group, and Kevin, I think, will bow out first because <laughs> he's old and he eats goldfish for lunch. Marvin, he owns a, his very own custom fitness Instagram. <laughs> it is custom. Round one, are you smarter than a fifth grader. Absolutely Oof. not when it comes to. Marvin, what is the plural of the word moose? He's gonna say meese. I'm gonna say it's still moose. Yes. <laughs> Ooh. What if it's moving though? Moose eyes? It's not still moose, it's moving moose. <laughs> Brian, so what is the biggest organ inside the human body? Inside? <laughs> That's a good body? question. You heard what he said. <laughs> the lungs? I don't know. No. What? It's the liver. It's the liver, bro. Don't act like you knew that. Oh, okay, okay. You got all squint eyes Mr. over there. Kinesiology major over here. Okay, boys. Why are you going to three, two miles an hour it's already? It's counting down. So, Kevin. Yes, sir. What was the first day? You made me more bored walking so slow. <laughs> what was the first day of the 20th century? What was the first day of, that's not a fifth grader question. No, it's a first grade question. <laughs> the date of the 21st century. Day, month. I mean, it would be January 1st. 20th century. 20th century, bro. <laughs> Boom. What year? The first year of the 20th century. Well, I cannot believe I don't know this. I would say, I want to say like 19. Everybody here is Googling it, so I don't feel too dumb right now. You bet you look dumb. The 20th century, you would think it'd be like the 2000s, but it's not, because they've been saying 20th century. <laughs> Whatever for the Evers. Wow, I don't know. I mean, you said that combined with the slow speed I'm January walking on the street. 19, 20,000, what? And, and one. It's 1901. January 1st, 1901. I knew. Did you guys not know? You, guys, you did not know that either, so don't be over there laughing behind the screen. You're literally pointing at no one. Second grade, Marvin. What are the first 10 amendments to the Constitution called? Bill of Rights. Correct! Hey, bro. Hey. Oh, bro. Hey. Bro. Hey. Okay, Brian. Brian. Brian just glad he didn't get that question. What is the term for a word that has the opposite meaning of another word? Bro. The opposite meaning of another word. Really? I got nervous. I just so got hot is No, the don't blank give me more clue. For cold. No, that was too much. You didn't give me a clue. Date, month, well, year. I mean, it would be January 1st. The opposite? Bro, I just went full on like. Kevin right now. Bro, I'm Kevin. <laughs> don't play me because you don't know what that is, yeah. bro. Okay, what the is opposite it? of synonym, I no, forgot. It's five, it's four, three, two. Antonym, I uh, What? What's the word? What is, bro, you knew it the whole time. No, I, I honestly thought that was a word I made up in my head. You no, think I you probably, made up antonym. Uh, Good job, bro. I made antonym. <laughs> I thought he just made up that word antonym. Now we move on to the third grade. Kevin, what is the closest planet to the sun? That's a third grade question? Yeah, they learned about the planets. I would say Neptune. Is that your final or, answer? Or. <laughs> no, don't give him. Or. Don't give him. I looked at him. Don't I, react. Yeah, but, you have Pluto, right? Who has Pluto? I do. I mean, the solar system. There's Pluto. What are you looking That's at, That's debatable. <laughs> Three. I'll say two. Venus. One. Mercury. Incorrect. It's Mercury. Uh, Brian is correct. You move up a half mile. Bro, it's common knowledge. You don't know antonym, but you know. Obviously, I did. I said it. Okay, now we move to the fourth grade. All right, Marvin. The ancient Egyptian writing system was called what? Hieroglyphics. Damn! Yeah. 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 Oh, Dude, you know who's the he was one here. Fourth grade. He reads them books, ma. Okay, Brian. Who wrote the national anthem of the United States of America? <laughs> uh, Michael Jackson. Three. Two. Snoop Dogg. <laughs> no idea. Francis Scott Key. I wow. personally did not know that. Two miles per hour. Marvin hasn't even started walking, guys. Oh. I'm getting cold. Oh. Bro, you Kevin, what do you call a group of crows? Kevin. Cries. 
A flock of crows. A murder, that is incorrect. What? Really? It's called a murder? Yes. When you see a flock of crows, you say, murder! <laughs> I want you to start walking, Marvin. So we're gonna move on to the fifth grade. The mountain range that includes Mount Everest is called? The Himalayans. He knows it. What, that's what? in India? What? what? No, he, he answered said, it! He answered it. He said Himalayas. He said Himalayans. Bro, that's like in Asia. I can't give that to you. It's Himalayas. Oh, oh, right? oh, oh no. actually, I'm gonna give it to no, him. No, don't give it to him. <laughs> Thank you. Know. Bro, that's like in Asia. I can't give that to you. It's Himalayas. Oh, oh, right? oh, oh no. Where can the deepest part of the world's ocean be found? Really, really, really deep? <laughs> Is that supposed to be a joke? <laughs> the Mariana <laughs> Trench. 2.5 miles per hour. I knew it was trench, but I didn't know yeah, what Yeah, sure you did. Hey, Kevin. Yes, sir. Other than water, what is the most consumed beverage in the world? I would say the most consumed beverage is milk. Incorrect. It's tea. Oh, what? They got tea all over the place, man. They got Chinese tea. They got English breakfast tea. Round two is called Take a Step Back. <laughs> I'm gonna show you guys an image on the TV of a super zoomed in photograph. Something that you may not even be able to recognize what it is. These are household items very close up. Brian, we're gonna start with you. <laughs> Household <laughs> items? What Ooh, are these? these? Oh, it's like, okay. Bro, are we seeing like cellular molecules? molecules? <laughs> are we seeing like Dang. cellular That's on molecules? the internet. That's gonna be the Molecule. internet, dude. Uh, corn? I don't know oh no, is. bro. Incorrect. Yeah! You didn't know! Bell you can totally Come tell. Come on. All right, Kevin. He you knows all the questions going. that he's not asked. What are these? Your hint is think education. I want to say that this is like a like a book or something. Like those are pages in a book. Pages in a book. Oh. That is correct. <laughs> pages in a book. Marvin, what is this? Oh, what? no hint. You no hint needed. What do you mean no hint. Molecules. Think the most important meal of the day. Breakfast cereal. That's too vague. Again, Marvin doesn't need to walk. Breakfast cereal, that's too vague. That's what it is. We're changing this topic to all play. So it's first person to shout it out. And the other two people have to get their speed increased. Done. In three, two, one. Chocolate. Um, bread. Um, cinnamon. Oh! <laughs> oh! It's cinnamon, boys. Oh. Marvin has oh. not even gotten anything yet. Oh, I didn't see the hint. Hey, hey, hey. Are you, hey, did you see the hint? Yeah, I did. I didn't see the hint. My brain froze when I saw the hint. Boom! Cinnamon stick. Oh, no, sorry, that was the answer. <laughs> <laughs> cinnamon stick. Boom! Zipper. Um, bottle cops. Oh, it's a drainer. A, a, a dra thing to unclog drugs. A snake. Clogs. A snake. Violin. I'm going to say thing, harmonica. I'm going to say the piano, keys in the piano. I'm going to say guitar. Guitar string. <laughs> I say guitar. You say guitar. That's I say guitar. Enough, Bro, no. Marvin gets to stay. Bro, I, I say yeah. guitar. Yeah. He Bro, say Marvin guitar. gets to stay. Joey. Yeah. Hey, that's yeah, Unite. <laughs> Yolk. A beer. A yeast. Uh, oil. Lemonade. Candy. Sticky gum. Honey. Honey. <laughs> okay, boys. No, Increase the speed. I'm oh. starting to perspire. Okay, now it's things are getting serious, oh, boys. Man. The winner of this next question gets to give a half a mile to whoever they want. <sighs> Actually, a full mile per hour to whoever they want. What is this? Um, a, a cookie that is a fortune cookie that is also. Um, Waffle! Pasta, pasta, pasta! Oh. Are you kidding me? Oh. How? Hey, who's it gonna be, Marvin? I didn't see Think Italy. Why am I not looking at the hint? Was I'm that the whole time? Uh, Brian for just being right here. <laughs> <laughs> Why am I not looking at the hint? Was I'm that there the whole time? A full mile per hour. That goes to 4.5 miles per power hour. Power walk, power walk. <laughs> <laughs> All right, round three. This is Zoology 101. Perfect. I went to a zoo once. Brian, Treadmill. which of the following mammals does not have tusks? A, walrus. Dude, how easy B, is that? B, elephant seal. C, narwhal. Or D, warthog. How easy is that? Narwhal. Incorrect. Speed oh, goes up. Plus two. Elephant seals. Elephant. Plus I'm one. Thinking, oh, hey, bro, I'm telling you right now, we got to speed this up because I'm getting tired. Oh, okay. You got it. <laughs> you got it. You got it. Right. No, no problem, buddy. I got you. <laughs>
Marvin, which of the following mammals has the most sensitive sense of smell? A, bloodhound, B, orca, oh, C, elephant, or D, horse? Or E, Brian? I'm gonna go with bloodhound. That is incorrect. Yeah. Both cat. <laughs> yeah. I was trying to trick him. Was I was orca? trying to trick him. Was it orca? It's elephant. elephant. Woo, oh, man. Him. Oh, bro. Bro, it's so obvious. Look how big their nose is, their trunk, bro. That's is that what no. <laughs> you guys all Hey, don't get too tired. Brian, yes. many people know the largest mammal is the blue whale. What is the smallest mammal by length? A, the pygmy shrew, B, the bumblebee bat, C, the chinchilla, or D, the naked mole rat? The pygmy shrew. Incorrect. Yes, yes, yes. 5.5 .5 miles per hour. Round four, this is Star Wars trivia. This one is the first person to answer. Got it? Who kissed Leia first, Han or Luke? Luke, Luke, Han. Brian got it right. That's an up in speed. Bro, and Marvin right? too. I am. Yeah. Bro, oh, no. No he just got to you first. He needs to go up like two or three. <laughs> For what? For being ugly. Who killed Han Solo? Scar. Darth Vader. No. No. Uh, um, who what? Who, who killed Han Solo? Scar. Oh no. Scar uh, oh my God. Ben Solo. I will take that. It's Kylo Ren. Kylo That's what I, it's the same thing. Yeah, he said I'll take hey, it. Hey, Kevin's going at six miles per hour. Uh, <laughs> focus. The sweat's getting in my eyes. Power walk, y'all. Power walk, y'all. Round six is pop culture. These are individual questions. Brian, this question's to you. Give it to me. Who did Forbes <laughs> name the youngest self-made billionaire ever in 2019? No idea. Kylie Jenner. Kylie 6.5 miles per hour for you, buddy. Yes. How many times did Ross Geller get divorced on Friends? Kevin. Twice. Three times. That is incorrect. 7.5 miles per hour. Oh, you dripped sweat on me. Oh, gosh. Just quit. Dude, Kevin is dripping sweat all, everywhere. Hey, he's leaning. That was disgusting. Oh, oh, he got me again. In the show The Office, who did Michael Scott hit with company property, the car, on company property? Meredith. That is correct. I down? did not give him speed. Down? No. Oh, down, you've been running too long. There we go, Joey. Bro, hey, Brian. Bro, come on here. No one's it's stopping you. It's hurting my back. No one's Ten stopping you. This death trap. Brian, which yeah. Avenger, other than Captain America, was able to pick up Thor's Mjolnir in the Marvel movies? Venom. <laughs> you gotta run. Vision. No, he gotta run. He said Venom. He said I'll Venom. I'll take it. I'll take it. I'm done. Oh, he's not out. <laughs> You're such a cheater, bro. I'm tired today. I can't, I can't play with you. Oh, he I can't. out. Marvin is the winner. Yeah. What the heck? Please leave a comment down below. Marvin is comfortable. Look at him. This is, that was heart. I showed some heart out there. Age is just a number. Congratulations to the smartest and fittest contestant. And I can put my shoulder on him because he's not sweating. <laughs> Guys, make sure you check out another extreme trivia challenge like Don't Fall Off the Plank, where we pulled planks as people were standing on them when they got trivia questions wrong. Also go check out this video somewhere around here that YouTube knows you're gonna enjoy. And subscribe to our channel and go watch some more videos. Goodbye.